Hello, my little maniacs. This is your host, the Maniacs Gaming. Coming back at you with another Madden Quickly 20. The league's top performers and the current Forgot to turn that off again. Hold on, let me go turn off the thing real quick. But we're coming back at you with another Madden 22 Speed Rebuild. And in today's episode, we are doing the New York Giants. Another request by a fan. So we'll go ahead and take a quick look at the roster as I will get 15 minutes to speed rebuild it, as well as five free agents due to the fact the Giants just absolutely suck. And yeah, uh, these are up to date with everything that's come out so far. It is currently Friday, July 22nd as I'm recording this. So, you know, as of the time I'm recording this, running backs and stuff no quarterbacks and o-line other than lovely trent williams and then some strength reigns etc have come out so o-line's not up to date yet so that's why evan neal's 79 he probably won't be he'll probably be more like mid 70s at best and daniel jones is a 70 and then uh, Kayvon Thibodeau's up to date. I am, however, going to give him star development. Even though I'm... Actually, no, because I'm probably not even going to use him. I'm not going to keep him if I can. You know what? Just on the off chance I have to keep him, we'll give him star development. But he should be where he's at. Wrong button. Madden makes it so much fun to push the ROM button. I really wish they would automatically do it where, like, it save and changes would be, like, the submit button when you click to back out versus, you know, the discard it because, like, I can't tell you the amount of times. Oh, it is save. It must be the roster I'm thinking of that's discard automatically. But anyway, this is the team, so better wide receiver one, maybe even wide receiver two. O line, except for Evan Neal and probably Andrew Thomas, needs to be upgraded. Upgraded tight end, quarterback upgrade, maybe a better running back than Saquon. And then just like the entire defense. So, yeah, I'm going to have my work cut out for me. Because, like, the Giants on paper kind of suck. So, let's go ahead and check out free agents and try to figure out what would be best for the team. We'll go with Ali Marpet, just because he's younger. And then, you know, let's get tight end taken care of, so I'm going to try to trade for that. We'll get Gronk. Gronk's out of retirement now, y'all. Then OBJ for a wide receiver. We'll bring him back to the Giants. And then, don't really need that... Let's get a middle linebacker just to sure up that defense a little bit. And then we'll get Joseph to sure up that D-line. There we go. Should be much better. So after that we go from a 76 overall. I don't expect to jump up too much. Go from 76 to 78, 79 offense, 77 defense. So obviously we need to prioritize center and quarterback on the offense. Maybe a better wide receiver 2 slash 1. Maybe. But other than that, offense should be pretty good. Maybe an upgrade at guard and tackle. Defense, just everything. Middle linebackers, oh... Little second middle linebacker, probably. Um, better left and right end, maybe. Cornerbacks are obviously going to be a thing. Going to do and safeties. And I am allowed to change the playbook, so obviously I probably will be going with Tampa Bay's playbook because that is personally what I know works very well. But I might try out Kansas City's. Yeah, I'll probably try out Kansas City's this video. But let's go ahead, and I have 15 minutes on the clock to try to do something good. Let me get my lovely timer set up. Time.
timer, 15 minutes. Alrighty. Ready, set, let's go. Alright, let's not worry about quarterback right away. So, let's try to get rid of Tyrod because he's older. He has value. Burrito might have some value. And then Kadarius Tony probably has some value. Hello. Teams are interested in Kadarius Tony. Ooh. I was wondering, I saw someone with green interest for... Does Tyrod just not have green interest? Ooh, ooh. Seahawks have interest in Tyrod. Let's go. How close would this be? Because, like... I think I might be able to make that work. Let's try Tyrod and Kadarius Tony. All right, what about the first pick, like a draft pick? Because we got the first overall pick projected and the first next year. So let's do f the first from next year. Okay. Let's take out Tyrod, because I feel like that's what's going to bring us down. Let's see. Do we have depth at right tackle we can trade? No. Left end? No, no. Where do we have depth I can trade? Alright, what about a corner? Do they want a corner? Kinda want a corner. Not enough to make it work. Alright, what if we send them Julian Love? He's young, they might want him. Nope. I think it's gonna have to be another first or maybe the second. Let's try the second, second rounder. All right, Jamal Adams for Kateri Stoney, a first and a second. Let's go. Now, what can I get from the, for Tyrod? Is there, all right. The Texans want Tyrod back. Let's see. How close would Brandon Cooks be? Not at all. But I can make it work. What about Laramie Tunsil? He's older. No. This is like straight up, I'll do it. Awesome, we'll get a slightly better cornerback. Alright, let's see. What else can I trade? Darius Slayton, maybe. I'll try Jordan Akins. This guy. Titans have interest in Slayton, but I don't know if they really have anything to be interested in. Kevin Byard or Jeffrey Simmons, I think, is what I'm interested in. Maybe Robert Woods. Let's try these two guys for Jeffrey Simmons. Okay. I think I can make that work. Let's try the second from next year. Ooh. Yeah, no, they're just not interested in that. What about Kevin Byard? Definitely not. Alright, Robert Woods. Let's just try it like a straight swap. Hell yeah! Let's go, we got a better wide receiver one now. Alright, he might even be wide receiver two. I don't know who they would have above the... Uh, who on the jump track. Is OBJ above since he's younger probably. So that's nice. Robert Woods. Alright, John Feliciano. And then, let's see, who else should I think of getting rid of? Back up right off the side linebacker. Any of these guys gonna have. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Not the Cowboys. It was the Colts have interest in my right outside linebacker. What about DeForest Buckner? Not even close. That's understandable. Darius Leonard? No. Matt Ryan. Not even close. Alright, what about... Kenny Moore could be interesting. Just kind of trying to feel out. Okay, Kenny Moore, I'll keep in mind. What about 
What about Brandon Smith? No. Yeah, after that, there's just not nothing worth it. Can I get Kenny for him and a second? That's a nice corner upgrade, so I'll take that. Alright. I think it's time to go look for a quarterback. Let's see. Obviously, we don't care about punter or kicker. Julian Lava might be able to package somewhere to get a corner. Like, a deep, like... These two might be able to package to get a corner. Ooh, f Falcons? No. Come on, I need someone that's interested in, that has like a quarterback I might want. Ooh. What's that? Seahawks, we don't care. Cardinals are interested in homes. Tyler's low. What about a... No, not Rodney. I want... What about a J.J. Watt? It's like, I can go trade the first for, like, fucking, for freaking, like, Tom Brady, if it, Tom Brady, and have a really good quarterback. We're giving up, like, pennies for J.J. Watt, honestly. Like, he's still going to be great in Madden. Alright, now they're getting a little bit, like, uh... Alright, fifth rounder. Alright, what about a fifth from this year? Alright, fourth from next year it is. Oh my god, dude, fine, fine. Fourth from this year, it's the same exact picture. It's just this year's draft versus next year's draft. Awesome. All right, now we really got to go get a quarterback. Let's see. Bucks, 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 bucks. Well, just about Brady and Vita Vea. Let's try to get something else in return, maybe. Um, Keem Hicks, because I haven't had a chance to update him yet. Let's go! That solved literally our quarterback issue. Like, look at that. Tom Brady's now on the team. Shaq Mason's now our right guard. No, wait, who did I get? Not Shaq Mason. Who did I get? Oh, yeah. A left end. Right. Now we got Akeem Hicks who can go to right end. And we got Vita Vea, arguably one of the best at his position. All right. I know I have Buda Baker, but I mean, Jamal, but like. Can I somehow make this work? If I can make that work... I don't think I have the draft picks, though. That's the issue. Yeah, no. I've traded, like, all my draft picks. But, like, that was a really good trade for us. So, like, I will not complain about that. Yeah, no. Keep moving. Our Chiefs are interested in both. Ooh. Mm -hmm. I mean, like, we really need, we do really need another middle linebacker, but, like, they don't have a good one. They don't have a good left or right outside linebacker. So, like, it would literally be at bare minimum D tackle, but I don't really need a D tackle. I need a second linebacker. Unless we go to a 3 4. You know what? Let's see. 
Leonard Williams for Chris Jones, and I'm... No. Okay, no. That's not going to work. What about Joe Tooney? Get another offensive lineman. Let's go. Alright. Well, like, what do we really need? Like, quarterback, we got Brady, we're good there. We got a running back, we're good. We got three really good wide receivers on us. Like, I would not complain about that. We got Gronk at tight end. We got Andrew Thomas to left tackle. Left guard, we got two guys, one of which is probably going to play right guard for me. Oh, we need a center. All right, let's try to trade this guy for, like, a center. And who's the other guy we can trade? Who's the other guy? It was a... I don't really need Joseph anymore, but, like, we'll keep him for now. Dexter Lawrence. The Colts. Do the Colts have a decent center? I actually do not know. Better than I currently got. Let's try. Awesome. We got a good... We got a decent center. So, O-line should be good. Like, we've got Andrew Thomas at... We got both our guards. We got a center. Try to trade this guy. Uh, let's see. We'll try to trade Lindvall Joseph if someone wants him. We got a right end. We could use an outside linebacker. Upgrade. Cornerback we might be good with. Free safety we could use an upgrade. Let's see. All right. Falcons are interested in Julian. Let's see. What about... Ooh, AJ Terrell, Grady Jarrett. Deion Jones would be an upgrade. Let's try doing this. Like, can I make this work? Maybe if I get something they want. What about... a? Danny Dimes? Okay. Alright, the best pick I have is the third. That's an issue. Let's try Daniel Jones for like AJ Terrell. Throw in Linval Joseph. And then the third. Alright, let's try the slightly higher third. Come on, I kind of want him. Wide receiver. They could use another wide receiver. They're interested in Galladay. Let's try this. Alright, what if we... No. What if we keep AJ Terrell? And then try to get Evans instead. No. That's actually slower somehow. What about Casey Hayward instead of AJ Terrell, and then we try for Dion? There we go. That's even better. We got a really good corner upgrade. Alright, let's go take the third and the two fourths, and maybe go get like an upgrade at linebacker. Uh, outside linebacker, just to get something else there. Let's, like, what about CJ Mosley? Like, I feel like I can make that work. Let's just try the third straight up for him. Nice, we got a better outside linebacker. All right, let's try the two fourths and a fifth. Or a right outside linebacker. Ooh. Let's try Preston Smith. 
If I can get something with like slightly higher value than that fifth, maybe. Oh man. Alright. Nope. Okay, last trade. They need a wide receiver. Let's try this. Alright, there we go. That's gonna do it. So I feel like I did pretty well there. Like all things considered, I think I made the Giants an eighty overall. Well, it's still same seventy six, but like we're gonna have to move positions around and crap, so like but I feel like we did pretty well there. Let's see. Giants are an eighty two overall. And that's without Tooney moved over. Let's go ahead and move Tooney over to right guard. Eighty one offense. Really? Best lineup, please. Thank you. So it's the offense holding us back, but like, like Evan Neal and Andrew Thomas will develop. Defense looking good. Like, 85 defense, like, other than safety. And then, obviously, outside linebacker were a little bit lackluster. Keon Jones actually has an upgrade point to spend. We'll go right into pass coverage for him. Get him up to a solid 85. Nice. Like, honestly, like, I can't complain about that. Alright, so we'll go ahead and change over to the lovely Chiefs playbooks. And we'll see how good the Chiefs playbooks are. I know they're, like, a lot of people use them because they say they're really good, but, like, I've never used them, to be honest. I don't even know where they're located. Tampa Bay, Cliff Clinsbury. There we go. Kansas City, Andy Reid. There we go. We'll find what scheme fits best. 86 vertical zone. And 86, 3, 4 under. Alrighty. We'll, we'll go ahead and simulate. Hopefully these guys develop nicely. Because if those tackles develop nicely, then we should be pretty good. Um, it wants to cut two players, so I'm going to do that so they don't cut anyone I don't want them to cut. Oh, okay. Okay. Well, that was easy. And yeah, we will simulate to playoffs. Where we should be part of them at like an 82 overall. Like, I feel like we couldn't easily make playoffs, but we'll see. I'll see you guys there. Make sure to check out that link down in the description. Help support me, support the channel through Blue Stacks. Would greatly appreciate it. All right, sorry, I was on Twitter, so I wasn't, I didn't start simulation earlier because Madden dropped the top 10 quarterbacks. Uh, Brady, 97. Aaron Rodgers, 96. Jesus, like, dog, how is he not at least a 98? Like, back-to-back -back MVP. Also, um, Giants went 15-2 and two under my leadership. So, like, yeah, apparently we did really well. So we're going to lose in the first round because that's the only way this makes sense. But, yeah, let's go ahead and check out stats. See who did really well. So, best offense in the league. Nice. And seventh best defense. So defense did pretty well. Let's check out stats. Tom Brady, 5,400 yards, a lot of yards. 55 touchdowns. Jesus. 10 interceptions. 
Like, like dog, don't matter. 1,200 yards for Saquon. 14 tutties. Receiving Erlen Shepard with 1,500 yards. 14 touchdowns. OBJ, 1,213. Gronk with 1,000. 15 touchdowns. And Robert Woods in there at 937, but 8 touchdowns. So, like, pretty decent. Defense, who did something great for me? I don't like the fact I'm only seeing one and a half sacks so far, but Hightower led the team in tackles. Who led us in sacks? Preston Smith with ten and a half. JJ Wall with ten and a half. Vita Vea with eight. Seven for the rookie, Kayvon. Three for Akeem Hicks. One for and a half for Dante Hightower. One for Kenny Moore. Half sack for Mosley. Desmond Kane. DJ Davidson. Got also got a half sack. That's nice. Let's see. I think Brady could have won MVP. Brady MVP with the Giants. Coach of the year. LT's money. Offense player of the year. Tom Brady. No other Giants. Defense player of the year. Cameron Jordan. No Giants. Offense rookie of the year. I don't expect to see anyone for us. Defensive Rookie of the Year, Micah Parsons, just like in real life. Kayvon Thibodeau in there at 8, though. Best quarterback to Brady. Best running back to CMC. But, of course. But, anyway. Let's see if we can get this team to the Super Bowl now that we've made playoffs. And all right, we got Dallas in the divisional. Can we beat Dallas? No, because Madden loves Dallas always. That's disappointing. But it's freaking Dallas. All righty, we're back now. And somehow now we're in 81. But here's the final look at the team before development changes and all that. Oh, but EJ got up to an 89. Evan Neal did pretty good developing. I don't know how the offense is an 81 overall because, like, dude, like, what would you change? Like, I don't know how the offense is an 81. Defense looking great. I love the fact that I got all stars on the defense. But, like, I should have known we were losing the second I saw Dallas. Because it's Dallas. Madden loves the Cowboys for no reason whatsoever. But we'll go ahead and send them to the Super Bowl. Probably see the Cowboys in the Super Bowl, honestly. Because that's how much Madden loves them. Nope. Green Bay versus the Chiefs. Trophy earned for, win my, for Brady win MVP. Because I apparently have never had a quarterback or anyone win MVP. But, yeah. Look at it. Dallas, of course, loses. But... But like, dog, what? But anyway, let's go ahead and check out the final team. OBJ goes up to superstar. Nobody else changed on offense except Gronk to star. Vita Vea, superstar X Factor. Nothing else changed. It's nice. But anyway, guys, that's going to do it. Make sure to hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and turn on that notification bell. And as always, I will see all of you guys later.